Alright, now normally I have a uh, money play going on today, but this is a week in the game. This is game number three. I did not play any more than three games because, well, having a baby and staying up to 2 a.m., having to work the next day is very exhausting. I'll put it like that. So, second and eight, this is Chicago Bears offense. If you guys are sick and tired of just seeing bunch, 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 and trip side ends and more bunch and 3 3 5 wide, more 3 3 5 wide, hit that sub button. This channel is a lot of off meta stuff. Now, currently in Chicago Bears offense, Kansas City on defense. There's a lot that's going to be broken down for members only. We'll be talking about that later on in this video. But I'm still learning some things about this. Now, this guy is in 3 3 5 normal, cover 4 drop. And he's putting his outside corners, his outside quarters, I guess you could say, into cloud flat, set to like 25 or 30, and his quarter flats to zero. And so it's just something you got to learn. We're going to take advantage of that as the game progresses. Every Saturday, members get access to an off-meta scheme. I'll also go into more detail about how to defend the meta using the Blitz from Friday's video. Hit that join button below, and I'll see you guys on Saturday. So, going back into the game, second and ten, we're going to be using Curl Flat a lot. Curl Flat, I like to just make simple adjustments. This one's on the channel, and if you're not really sure about joining, well, you can check out the mini scheme, or the full scheme, really, I guess, available for free on my channel for anybody now i like to just run this wheel route again and again and again the biggest problem with this doubles offset week is it doesn't have a good wheel route it has you can hire out a wheel route but it's not like the mess spot wheel route the mess post wheel route you know that disgusting nasty running back wheel route that literally beats everything doesn't got that unfortunately that's the one downside about this but we can make it work so we are now up seven points we got ball to start and so you have to keep in mind, you're, you know, since you're playing down, so with that mindset, you got to play like that, right? You got to play like you're behind, so you want to play ahead, if that makes any sense. So uh, this guy likes to go ahead and run inside zone. He's running this wing slot offset, I believe is what it's called. I don't know what I think about it. 4-3 even, I don't know what I think about the 4-3 even. I'm pretty much almost all the way done with 4-3 even. And what's really weird with this game is I get clicked onto a whole bunch of random players. So I'm off of my actual user probably like a good 50% of the time. I, I, I don't know why. But right there, I was going to think he was going to throw to the flat. Because we went to the flat, we manned up the two receivers with our safety in our outside corner. And so you can see right there, take, check, we'll take away the check down, shoot it to go over the top. Takes over the top, easy one play touchdown. So... First and 10 again, cover four drop, he uses it, lurks it. <laughs> Try playing weekend league at 2 a.m. <laughs> you tell me how well it goes for you. It just never ends well for me. That's why I can't play I can't play Madden super late into the night, I guess, super early in the morning. I'm just not awake enough to play it, as you guys saw. So, again, quarter flats right there. A is going to be wide open. I should have just threw A as a low point pass right here. X wide open for one play. Touchdown, nope. Again, he puts his outside quarters into cloud plots that's what he does every single time and we try and take advantage of that but madden giveth and madden taketh so right here we had x open i don't know where his user was we were actually looking for that post route because i was thinking he was converting it to a cover two but he actually ran inside quarters almost the entire time right there we're playing a little bit of a hybrid defense good i think this is good defense i don't know where my inside quarter was to begin with a deep half doesn't play that. Inside third doesn't play that. Inside quarter doesn't play that. It's one of those stupid, what I like to call idiot plays that literally beats everything. Now, right there, my user gets stuck on the receiver. I was actually going to back to cover that drag route, but we get jammed. So that's kind of unfortunate. Now, right, here he goes. Gun tray. I'm going to go ahead and shade down with front table route for the running back. And we're going to go ahead and actually shoot. He runs an inside zone. I was an edge blitz three. And so edge blitz three is really, really difficult to shoot inside zone. You can check there. I've, I've never had an issue shooting inside zone, but goal line, 5-3 uh, blitz. I can't remember what the play is, but right there, you just stand in the gap, and we get a stop. We are now down three points in the fourth quarter. We're looking for A. We're actually looking for B over the top. Again, dot. What it was I was talking about? Look downfield, and he, he's going to give up a touchdown every single time. I just need to take away, just take advantage of these streaks. Now, we skip a lot because he just checked down, checked down, checked down. And what's crazy about that particular play is there's a hook curl right there. That's why zones are so bad this year because you don't know where they're going to play. My hook curl was playing in the flat. You would have thought that was a curl flat the way that it played. Now right here, he mans up the running back with the outside quarter, so we're going to go ahead and take the little hitch. This is adjusting on the fly. This is what separates the good from the great. Adjusting on the fly. Yeah, you have your set route combinations. You have your set plays you like to go to. But if you can't read a defense, 
ebooks don't really, in my opinion, help you all too much because they give you set route combinations, but they don't ultimately tell you, hey, what exactly they're doing on defense, and we're going to take advantage of that. Now, this is the biggest issue with zone drops. We get lucky right there, but you know what? I don't really care. This guy sucks at the game. But right here, we're going to go and take a little hitch route. Please break that first tackle, bro. But fourth and one, you know what? I could go for three. I could be a hoe and go for three right here. <laughs> but this isn't the MCS. This is weak in league. Who cares, right? Who cares? We're going for it. Fourth and one, 19 seconds, one timeout left. If we don't get this, this is going to be game over. Spacing switch out of the empty bunch. Looking for RB, low point pass, dot. That the game is not over. 14 seconds left. You know this guy's got some demonic pass in his play. He's got some sort of... Who knows what he's running in? <laughs> and nobody knows. Okay, 14 seconds, two timeouts left. He is down four. He needs a touchdown. In that case, if this is the MCS, okay, if this is the MCS, you obviously go for three. But if it's a season's game and the game doesn't matter whatsoever, you go for a touchdown. You go for the guap. You go for the, the, the put them in the coffin and finish it. So, gun wing slot offset. We're going to come out in 3 2 6. I'm going to go into I'm gonna go into this edge blitz three. And we're just going to send a simple blitz. Okay, this is a four-man blitz. I'd like to make sure that my Ed's third elite is not in a contain usually. But right here, we're just going to play deep. Okay, I was just worried about those post routes because I knew they were going to be everything you have on the field. And so he goes ahead and takes that. You can have that. Now, Gun Trey, he's running double in sale previously. So I am not super worried about the table route because, again, six seconds. You got to get something going for you. Right here, nothing open. And my lord. He catches that. Thank the good Lord. Time's over. Game's over. And somehow we pull off the win. If you guys are new to the channel. <laughs> and you, you're just as confused as I am. And as how he caught that without deep out elite. He just straight up agged me. No click on. He didn't swerve. He just straight up agged me. Whatever. EA Sports. It's in the game. If you guys want more off meta stuff. Be sure you hit that sub button. That is the main part of this channel. That is this channel. It's off meta. We, not, we might not be as good as Henry, or we might not be as good as some bunch players, but you know what? We're having a heck of a lot more fun playing off-meta offense and some off-meta defense as well. So with that being said, if you want to join today, get some more details about the defense and offense I'm running, hit that join button, and we'll catch you guys in the next one.